Baby Bus. Let's go, Sheriff Labrador. The Miracle Shape Me Up Pill, Part Three. While Sheriff Labrador and Officer Doberman were crouched under the window of the factory, stealthily observing what was going on, they suddenly heard a voice behind them. Hey, who are you? <laughs> uh oh. Uh -oh. They looked back and saw a Zebra, the factory employee, in overall standing behind them. Whew. Fortunately, the Zebra did not recognize them as Sheriff Labrador and Officer Doberman because they were wearing plain clothes. Sheriff Labrador, always unflappable, scratched his head pretending to be embarrassed. <laughs> Hello, sir. We work for Mr. Bleeder. Uh, we're here to move the goods. Where is the warehouse? Uh, sorry, it's our first time here, so we're a bit lost. <laughs> oh, I see. Well, in that case, come with me. Sheriff Labrador winked at Officer Doberman in agreement. Officer Doberman immediately understood the assignment and stuck up a warm conversation with the zebra. Hey now, dude, I just saw Miss Bell. I assume she's here to buy pills too. No wonder she looks even more beautiful. That zebra glanced at Officer Doberman and gave him a strange smile. Naive, you are so naive. Miss Bell was not here to buy pills. The zebra glanced around and lowered his voice. To tell you the truth, Miss Bell is our real boss. She's the one who invented the Shape Me Up pill and built this factory, but she never takes a pill. <laughs> she eats three square meals a day. Aha! Sheriff Labrador and Officer Doberman looked at each other and nodded tacitly. They began to pretend to carry the goods and then sneaked out when the zebra wasn't looking. As soon as Sheriff Labrador and Officer Doberman were out of the yard, they got into their car and drove off quickly. Hey now, what do we do next, Lab? Doby, I need you to go back to the station and get a search warrant. We're going to shut down this pharmaceutical factory. The real owner of the factory is Miss Bell. She just said she's doing a TV interview. I'm gonna go to the TV station and expose her true colors on live television. Everyone needs to know the whole truth. The spotlights in the studio shone on Miss Bell, which made her look even more radiant than usual. Both reporter Hippo on stage and the audience gazed at Bell with a sort of adoration. Miss Bell, what is your secret to retaining the title and keeping your perfect figure? <laughs> it's in large part due to taking Shape Me Up. Bell proudly introduced the tablets she had brought with her. She took out a round tablet and showed it to the camera. This tiny tablet is packed with a variety of nutrients. With each one of these you take, you will become more and more beautiful and charismatic. Whoa! The audience applauded enthusiastically. I'm going to take a Shape Me Up tablet every day! Yeah, just like Miss Bell does! Right! I want to do it too! You're full of it! Suddenly, the studio door swung open. Sheriff Labrador strutted in. A beam of wisdom flashed behind his dark, round eyes. Sheriff Labrador walked slowly up to Miss Bell and flashed his police ID badge. Hello, Miss Bell. I am Sheriff Labrador. Based on our investigation, you are suspected of false advertising and selling fake drugs. Please come with me to the police station for further investigation. Th that's a bunch of nonsense. I, I haven't done any of those things. Really? To everyone listening, please don't put your trust in this so-called shape-me-up pill. After our investigation, we've identified that the tablets only contain china clay and water. What? This clay swells with water, and the individual ingesting it may feel full after eating it. But actually, it does not contain any nutrients, and if consumed in excess, it will endanger one's life. Huh? What in the world? Are we cheated by Miss Bell? You! Do, do you have any proof? I, I'll i sue you for defamation! Belle quibbled, but she was in a panic. Do you want to see proof? All right, let me show you. Sheriff Labrador turned on his phone and projected a video of the tablets making process taken at the factory onto a large screen. The audience was stunned to see the truth. Huh? Oh! Oh! You lied to us! Oh my! Shake Me Up is no miracle tablets! I... I 
I've been deceived too. I just endorse it. I've been taking it, seriously. I'm just as much of a victim as each of you. As Belle noticed her cover was blown, she put on a pathetic look and was on the verge of shedding tears. <laughs> Hold on, listen carefully. Then Sheriff Labrador played a recording. <laughs> to tell you the truth, Miss Bell is our real boss. She's the one who invented the Shake Me Up pill and built this factory, but she never takes a pill. <laughs> she eats three square meals a day. It, it's... <sighs> Bell's legs turned to jelly and she fell to the ground speechless. Not only the studio audience, but also all the Forestville residents who watched the live interview knew the truth. Thereafter, none of the animals in Forestville have taken any weird pills. <laughs>